Thank you, Meg. Someone wrote to the New York Times saying their girlfriend of six months said, I love you. And they want to know if they should say it back, even if they're not sure. So, should they say it back? Of course not. Never. If this is how you are going to start your relationship, in this article, they've been together for only six months, right? This is one, one of the first big tests of communication in a relationship. If you're going to start with a lie, the rest of your relationship is doomed. There is a way to handle this, I think, because... If someone says it and you're still not sure, you're better off saying, listen, thank you so much for saying that. It's six months, this is going great, and I want us to keep going so that I would be able to say to you <laughs> how I feel <laughs> about this. Uh, uh, so uh, hold on, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I will say this, there's a way to do it. So when I started dating my husband, he started to say to me, I like you a lot. And then I was like, oh, I like you a lot. And then over the next couple of weeks, it's like, I really, really like you. And then he's like, I really, really like you. And then without saying he was falling in love with me, he said to me, I'm going to make you fall so in love with me. Oh, tricky. And what that was why I loved that. Did you think that. he was hypnotizing you? Like, no, I loved it. Yeah. What I thought, and I still think to this day was, he was telling me where his heart was at right. without making me feel like I had to respond with an I love you okay, back. Okay, so here's the deal. That oh, sounds that's very, very sweet. But Arthur, do you want to take this or should I take this? I mean, go ahead. Okay, so here's the deal. That sounds lovely. And you guys are married and that's wonderful. But here's the deal when you're dating someone and you're in that position where you still like them and you still want to hang out and you want to have a nice evening. But they've dropped the L-bomb on you and you have a choice. Either you're going to say it back and have a good evening or you're going to like just let it flop there on the table or say thank you or some other weird thing that's going to ruin the whole chemistry that you guys already have. And I know it's going to shock you. You guys may hate me, but I say just say it back. It's easier just to say it back. No. I know. Here's the deal. Okay. You, know, a lie. you know what's it's wait, a wait, wait. Lie. Here's the deal. People lie about it's the orgasms that they are not having. Yeah. And you have no problem with that. Yeah. You are not about your financial situation when you meet people and you have no problem with that. So yeah. I say, you know what? Say it. Be like, you know what? I love you too. Let's yeah. get the let's get the garlic bread and I'm let's gonna, keep this evening moving. I'm going to back you up because everyone here, including all of you panelists, except because you've just said, all of you are lying because all of you have said I love you to someone and when you didn't mean it. You thought there may be a chance that down the road it would become the truth, but in the moment you said it because they said it first and you guys were You're trying to build something. It's You're not a about coward. cowardice. No, it's not coward. Because you are also, a coward. No. this is how I know you've been married for a while. You're not on the streets. Because if you're sitting... <laughs> If you're, matter, if you're sitting with someone and they say, I love you, and you go, well, I like hanging out with you. And when Night's time over. comes, they're just going to get up and walk the out. Because here's the thing. That's the most vulnerable thing. And as a society, I feel like we've, we've turned I love you into something very weird. And pressure around it has become very weird. Because, yes, people should be allowed to say it when they are ready. That's not how any of us think, though. You say I love you, and if you don't get it back, all of a sudden your entire being is being questioned. And so there's no way... Of and you're yes. not the same. Honesty would be great, but none of you can handle honesty. <laughs> you know what? That's maybe, a fact. Maybe we should get married. Thank you. Maybe we well, should get married. Yeah. Yeah. Break and leave that we right the there, yeah. everybody. <laughs> Just saying. Fifteen years happily married over here, so it worked out okay. Yeah. Hey there, what did you think? Drop your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you can find more on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. See you soon.